Okay, we're back with the Heyman and Dan show for another week. Another spooky week. Yeah. Spooky. It's gonna be some more spooky stuff. And today we're twinning. Yeah. With our Steelers go jersey. Steelers. Yes, go Steelers. That's us right now. We're literally doing that. Even though today is like college jersey, we're wearing jerseys. So we're like, we, yeah. we did it halfway. So. <laughs> And today we're going to start you off with weather, but we have a special guest. Yeah. So come on out. All the way from the state of New York. New York, New York. Oh. Say so your name. This is Ingrid. my house. I'm in 10th grade. Um, for today's weather, um, it's going to be a 63. The lowest is going to be 63 with 81. For Monday through Friday, Monday's going to be the lowest of 56. To 76. Tuesday, the lowest is 43 to 61. Wednesday, 38 to 62. Thursday is 36. And the highest will be 64. And Friday will be 41, but the highest is 68. Monday, Tuesday, will not be. Yeah, Monday, Tuesday, will not be here because. It's a teacher, holiday. Yeah, is it? Or is it teacher work day? It's, teacher it's a holiday work. for us. It's a, it is a holiday for us, but it's a work day for teachers. Thank you for helping us. Thank you so much. Work. You are incredible. Yeah, thank yeah. you. Okay, so we're gonna move on to our next segment where we are reviewing a spooky album this week. We found a spooky album. And what is that album, Haven? Well, it's an EP. Um, it's the Bullet Brothers, Time to, to Die. die. Time, to, to die. Time to Die EP, which is like, the Bullet Brothers are just like, they are Halloween. They are spooky, they are spooky. The or, album cover spooky. was very much giving yeah. spooky Halloween. Right. If you don't know who the Billy Bros are, they're alternative drag artists who um, run the show, the, the Boulet Brothers, wait, Dracula, the Boulet Brothers search for the next drag song, so I forget it, but that's great, so we are going to cover that next week, I'm going to get Haven to watch it, we're going to cover that, but um, what what do you think about this um, EP? I thought the, the sound of the album was very distinct, it was definitely on a... Had a theme. It had a theme. Yeah. You could follow it. Yeah. Each song had like kind of like a similar sound, but also had like a different like rhythm and like meaning. And I thought it was very spooky. I thought it was very much giving some Lady Gaga vibes. Yeah, and, it's and there's only four long songs. It is a tiny EP. Yeah. But, like just listen to that. Like I'm waiting for the Bully Brothers album. Like they need to. Sure. And it's very much Halloween. So. It was very alternative and distinct. And very, because like you don't really get a lot of Halloween. You don't. And that's something you could definitely treat. Yeah. What was your favorite um song on the album? Oh and the EP. What's like the last one? Um, uh, R.I.P. R.I.P. I love R.I.P. I like, like that one. R.I.P. is probably my favorite too. I really like Wicked Love. Um, but yeah, that was our EP this week that we covered. Spooky Oogie. Now we're gonna move on to our next segment. Haven, help us. I. <laughs> Every time we do this, you literally. Haven, help us. Okay, Haven, what's the question you got for this week? Okay, so we're going to do one question this week. We're going to keep it a little bit short and a little bit sweet and a little bit simple. So, this question is My boyfriend is graduating this year. And I'm sure he's going to break up with me once he goes to college. A very, a very simple question. Yeah. Um, I'll let you, I'll let you go first. So, I don't really know if I should be answering this because I am not a bad relationship. You but, don't, I'm just kidding. What? Nothing. So, I would just say you would have to have a sincere conversation with him. Put everything out on the table. Yeah, for Have real. a discussion. Be true to yourself. Don't leave anything unanswered. Because you basically said yeah. that's it. Sometimes things just don't work out, you know. College, long distance things don't always work out. So yeah, he it's might. really sad, but it could work out. Maybe he's not gonna break up with you. If he's loyal, if he loves you, you guys can visit each other a lot, then it would be good. Yeah, you should definitely talk about it. Yeah. Because Conversation is key in a relationship, so it's like in where the crowd mm -hmm. scene, they didn't talk about it and then he was gone. And nothing, nothing changed. Yeah, so yeah, exactly. Just talk to him. Um, we hope that you do that because that's what you need to do. Very much that. 
Okay. I think that about does it for this week of um, yes. the Haven and Dan show. Um, spooky wow. edition. We covered a spooky album, and the weather's pretty spooky. Yeah, it's sunny. And also, we're not going to be here Monday and Tuesday, so we get a four-day week. Four days, though. Oh, my God. And this week was Spirit Week. Yes. This is our Thursday outfit, because we film on Thursdays. But we're going to do a montage right now of all of our Spirit Weeks. No word. Can you film us? Can you call us Landslide? Yeah. Landslide. Landslide. It's already recording. She doesn't even go here. I'm Janice. Yeah. I'm Damien. She doesn't even go here. Yeah. No. Okay. Go on. I'll show the back. <laughs> hey guys, it's Haven. Hey Haven. Hey. Haven says hi. We're just film we're filming for journalism. Hey guys, it's Haven. Inside school. Inside. We're near the end of the second quarter, and so far this war is twenty. This is going on the school website. Oh, we're beating them. And it's sixty degrees, so. And um, the heat is up. No. Okay. Um, bye, Haven and Danvers. We love y'all. Cult pride. Peace in the streets. Spooky oofy. The Haven and Dan Show. We keep you in the know. If you have a question and you know where to go, the Haven and Dan Show.